What is down everybody? It's your main course little pancake. Welcome back to another video today. We are back in trying things. Number 15. That's cool. That's five more than ten. Today we have two things, two very interesting things, I must say. So, TGI Friday's potato skins style snack crisps. Cheddar and bacon. And here it's always Friday. So I like Fridays. That's item number one. And the second item is something very interesting. Ready protein water. I saw this, I've, I've seen this, um, like every time I go into the little convenience store on campus, they, they have the, I can't speak. They got these like two weeks ago and they've just been intriguing me. 20 grams of protein. This is what we're gonna try first. And then that way if it's good, I can sip on it while I'm eating my potato skin chip crisps or whatever 20 grams of protein which is pretty hefty like that's a lot of protein i don't feel like this is gonna be good i wanted to get the most interesting flavor so i got cotton candy grape i i highly doubt that this is gonna be good i feel like trying to make a cotton candy flavor with zero sugar is um an interesting challenge based on the fact that cotton candy is probably like 99% sugar. More protein and even better taste. Remember, it's not where you start, it's where you finish. Always working to make your best better. Let's get, let's look at the ingredients. Water, whey protein isolate. That sounds good for you. Acid, acid, flavors, monk fruit extract. There's a monk in here? How'd he get in there? How do you extract a monk? I feel like they wouldn't like that. Sounds like a like an assault charge coming up. I feel like it's gonna be very heavy. I need to stop talking about it. I need to try it. That's what I need to do. Oh geez, that smells horrendous. Good lord. It smells a little bit of like spoiled milk. Gonna be honest, doesn't smell like cotton candy. This does not make me think I'm at a fair. Hey, it might taste amazing. All right, smells can be deceiving. Let's go for it. Oh wow, that's bad. Good lord. Who thought that was a good idea? My mouth feels that I think I might be allergic to that. Oh. What in the world? Good grief. Who did this? This is a crime against humanity. Just eat a steak or something. Uh I'm putting the cap on that. Jesus. It, oh. There's no cotton candy or grape. It just tastes like ass. Pardon my French, but bonjour, mi amor. That was Spanish. What am I? Well, that was half Spanish, half French. I, this stuff got my languages all messed up. I can't even speak English. Oh God, um, it's like a bad protein bar. You ever had one of those protein bars that just like, like tastes like whey? Like it's just protein. Like they said, flavor is a secondary priority here. We just want this to be protein. Tastes like that if you melted it down and then like peed in it. This is just that. Oh my gosh, that's offensive. I'm offended. That might be one of the worst things I've tried. My mood has been decreased because of this. What in the world? I got to give that like a 12 because I didn't vomit. So that's a plus. That is just bad. It's not the worst thing I've ever tasted, but it there there are no good qualities to it. There is nothing I see that I'm like, yeah, so I could see why people would like that. That is just 100% bad. Like, they're 0% good. I won't say 100% bad. It's 0% good. Oh, all right. I got to get my taste out of my mouth with some TGI Friday potato skins, cheddar, and bacon snack, snack, snack st styles. Style snack crisps. I actually have high hopes for these. I really like uh, TGI Friday potato skins. Not like actually from TGI Fridays. I probably haven't been to a TGI Fridays in like 10 years. But the frozen ones, slap. It's 
smells like a barbecue chip. Yeah, it smells just like like Lay's barbecue chips. A little crispy. It's a little thick. It's a little thick boy right there. Hm. That's heavy on the bacon flavor. That's not great. If you've ever had the um bacon flavored sunflower seeds. Yeah. Everybody's had those. It tastes a lot like that. When people try to replicate the flavor of bacon into something that's not bacon, it usually doesn't go well. And they went really heavy on the bacon flavor here. And I think it was a mistake. I think you should have leaned more on the cheddar, me personally, because the bacon kind of sucks. It's, now, it's nothing compared to the ready protein water. Let's just not even discuss, uh, let's not even talk about that. Okay, let's just move on from that. It's not terrible, right? It's inoffensive. If you like that fake bacon, you'd probably really like these. The, the actual chip or crisps that they caught is actually pretty good. It's got a good crunch to it, a nice thickness, um, good body, you know. I feel like they just went too heavy on the bacon flavor and didn't really work out that well. It's still not bad, though. It's I mean, it's fairly solid. I think I'm going to give that, like, 59. Like, it doesn't hurt me. It's not offensive in any way. It's just kind of, eh. It's not like, dang, I want that again. But it's not like, ooh, get that away from me. You know what I mean? While this stuff, don't... All right, this is a, this is an announcement. This is my review. I, I'm sure the people at Ready Corporation probably find people. Yeah, you know, we can hang out or whatever. But, but y'all got to rethink this, dude. Maybe take it down to like 10 grams of protein or something. Because at the end of the day, if I want a, a drink that's got protein in it, I'm going to just drink milk. This isn't even lactose intolerant friendly because it says contains milk right there on the allergen statement. So like, it's not even an alternative to milk. How much does, how much protein does milk have in it? Hold on, let me do a little research real quick. Okay, one cup of whole milk contains eight grams of protein. Would you rather drink a cup of, three cups of whole milk or th I would rather drink like 12 cups of whole milk than this. Like, I'm not going to say that I would vomit if I drank. This made my mouth feel weird, too. It coated my mouth. Here we go. Pat Kavanaugh. Pat, you got to you gotta go back to the drawing board, boss. I know you're thinking, like, I'm going to drink this stuff and it's going to make me jacked. But it's not. It's just going to make you feel bad. Also, just take the flavor out of it because it doesn't have flavor. So, don't drink the ready water. Protein. It's not worth it. The potato skins, if you like that fake bacon flavor, I'd recommend going for them. They're not bad. Um, thank you guys so much for watching this trying things. Let me know if you have had any of these before. Maybe you're a big protein water fan. I'm going to stick to uh, meat. Have a wonderful rest of your day, everybody. Smash like, subscribe, and I'll see all y'all later.